So grim about the homestead now that Miss Abigail and little Connor have passed. I've seen Achilles crying. Why shouldn't he? It's just that he doesn't look sad. He looks furious. It's unsettling. He's struggling with the loss. We all are. I know. But it's been months. And we've done little but search for this blasted manuscript and box. Le Chasseur has a lead on the box. We're to meet him and Chevalier in St. John's. Chevalier too? No hope of cheering me up then. When Achilles said whoever had the artifacts could access sites of great power, what does he mean? I'm not sure I understand it myself, sir. I had a long talk with Adam Wally about that. He believes the box can be activated to project words or images. Like a magic lantern. What do you mean? You know the magic lantern shows Father Connolly put on in the church basement? The box had a candle in it, I think. He put these little glass blades in front. Then we'd see the images projected on the wall, like cathedrals in Rome. Bright and near as big as life. Ah, yeah. I suppose it is. Except that it interprets the strange language of the manuscript, too. If the plate were of a banner in Latin, we'd see it in English. How is that possible? Who knows? I fear we might never truly understand how any of the pieces of Eden work. Where in the world has the most beautiful girls? I suppose it depends on your vision of beauty. A damsel from Corfu and one from Oslo are as different as chalk and cheese, but both could be lovely. You see, opinions like that give a man a reputation for wisdom. Yeah, thank you. I would have just said Havana. The girls there have lusty buttocks and bosoms and feel no shame in putting them on display. But that's no slight against our lasses from home. We're almost there, Captain. Le Chasseur will be expecting us. And Chevalier. That's a small price to pay for a lead in the precursor box. Chevalier, what happened to your vessel? I got myself into a bit of a scrape. Sent three ships in all hand to their watery grave. The Giafu nearly followed them down. Just your fate has been better, Le Chasseur. Indeed. My sources inform me that Samuel Smith has searched far and wide, looking for answers on how to make that strange box work. He just returned from Europe. Where is he now? Refitting his schooner. If you hurry. You can catch him... there. Oh, remember those blueprints? Well, I had an engineer build that marvelous weapon for your ship. Master Puckle's gun fires more shots than an artillery brigade, and twice as fast. Many thanks. Anything for my hooded friends. Captain, I will join you on this voyage. Then shall we, gentlemen? You are in a jovial mood, Shay. Why shouldn't I be? 
I have a new weapon, and will soon have a chance to use it. Besides, Templars are usually well guarded, and I'm sure that Smith fellow is no exception. I also took the liberty of ordering some improvements. Morgan now has a ram cut through ice itself. I have heard of such technology, but never witnessed its operation. What about Smith, then? Is he close by? Aye, he sails these very waters. And he may have the precursor box. Then let's find him. There he is. Most fortunate timing. Lady Luck never ceases to smile on you. He's seen us. Give chase. But hold your fire. We must not damage the box or risk losing it to the sea. Can't this bucket go any faster? At least my ship is still seaworthy, Chevalier. Our target's a smart man, but out of his element here. What he's doing in these waters is beyond me. Maybe he came here to meet someone, or ran into your pirates. He's refitting his ship. Something must have happened. If one of my allies attacked me, I would have known about it. Well, he's back from a long voyage. Now's our chance. Came out of the way. Washington entrusted the precursor box to him. He probably still has it. She's right. The box comes first. So we can't sink him. We'll have to board his ship or force him to beach. Look, Captain. He's cutting through the ice. It seems you're not the only one equipped with such a ram, Shay. Let us hope ours fares just as well. Way is clear. Now, uh, once more, your fortune holds. But do not waste time congratulating yourself. Smith is giving away. These waters are full. It's an ambush. Off where you sit, young on our fans. Smith must not escape. Don't see Smith's ship. Let's get rid of these distractions first. We'll find him. Fire! Fire! Smith, he's 
moving again. No doubt he hoped to be a spectator of your demise. I'm glad to disappoint him. And he's still within reach. Wickedness is this! Another Templar tactic. They can cover whole stretches of ocean with their flames. Careful, Shay. We could be burnt to cinders. It's nothing more than a last desperate throw of the dice. He knows we have him. Loose and trip too. Loose sail. Put out all she'll take. Training is prepared. Trip the yards off the wind. Tops, gallants, royal studs. I'll Reach the close range. my eyes and Two dream of All sail, shall take it. Close down. And your seats. Sir. Four. Now we know where he was headed. Barson has an encampment here. Follow him on land. Do not even think of firing the ship's weapons near that precious box. I'll take care of this. Anchor away. Artifact. Treasure from those who came before. Yes. It matters not. <coughs> Some of the greatest scientific minds of all Europe could not make it work. <coughs> now all I need is the manuscript, and all shall be revealed. the precursor box. Smith's dead. Well done, Shay. Where's Chevalier? Returning to Ligure Faux. We'll have to celebrate without him, I'm afraid. I don't much feel like celebrating Liam. I know we have to get these artifacts back, but... At what? Samuel Smith. 
He could barely hold his sword straight. And hit. Loose all and trip sharp to the wind. Loose down. On your seats. Thanks for your trust, Captain. You're here. Congress is still in session. George Washington and his militia have fired on French troops under Jumonville. The French are calling it an act of war. George Washington. You mean Lawrence's younger brother? Yeah, it's the same. I'm speaking of Lawrence Washington. But you eliminated him. James Wardrop has moved up in ranks. All the Templar resources are at his disposal now. 
What about the manuscript? My sources in New York confirm that Wardrop has it. I also learned that he is here at the Congress under heavy guard. Shay, find Wardrop. Get that manuscript. This place is thick with Templar troops. Liam and I will make sure he doesn't escape. That must be the Templar William Johnson. Perhaps he has the manuscript, or knows where it is. As I have stated previously, I believe we need a national union, granted by an act of parliament, but bringing greater independence to our colonies. The French are an immediate threat, and we are ill prepared to face them. To put it bluntly, the colonies must join, or die. Rousing speech, Master Franklin. But do you truly believe Great Britain will grant our colonies autonomy? They have little choice, Master Johnson. You know the remoteness of this frontier better than most. Yes. But let us leave politics for another day. I wanted to thank you for your research. Of course. Of course. In the brief time I could examine that box, I could tell it was something unique. From ancient Egypt, you said? Well, as I mentioned in my letter, I am quite ready to... Electrify it. Excellent. We will have the box delivered shortly. As for the manuscript... Captain? I apologize, sir. But Master Wardrop refused to hand it over. He said the risks were too great. The risks? Ah. I apologize. You will have the manuscript and the box in the briefest of delays. You mean the excuse for a uniform? Run to Fort Frederick and tell Master Wardrop he had better cough up the manuscript post-haste. Else I will have him scalped. I can't let that lobster captain reach Wardrop. Hold that. I love us, yeah. Right. Don't lose sight of him! Keep till he tires. Close in on him! And now the war's right. The man is screaming.
I'll take that, you Templar dog. No! You have no idea what you're doing, fool! Keeping the people free from your control. How free will you be when the French undermine these squabbling colonies? These colonies would be far better off without the Templars pulling the strings. <laughs> we bring order from chaos. If everything is permitted, no one is safe. Even the devil can quote scripture to suit his own purposes. You're late. The sky is getting temperamental. That's not the only thing, is it? Uh, Master Franklin, sir. My name is Shay, and this is my associate, Hope. Uh, William Johnson told us to give you these. Ah. 
thank you, but I'm afraid I must delay my experiment. Delay it? Why? The army confiscated my lightning rods. They are essential to conducting the electricity. I need to vivify your box. Master Johnson would not want you to have to wait. Perhaps there is something you can do, then. Soldiers have been hauling things away all day. Perhaps they could tell you where they've taken my lightning rods so you could get them back. At your service, sir. Begin your investigation at the market near the docks. I will stay here and help with the preparations. This is intolerable. I can barely conduct my work anymore. Sure, you're seeing things, but I'll take a butcher. I keep well clear of that place. They say that man messes with lightning. Speaking of lightning, I reckon there's a storm coming. Aye, let's hope she demures until we're off duty. Is that the last of it? Yes, it is, sir. Good. Put it with the rest. I wonder what Master Franklin plans to do with these rods. This 
storm's getting worse. Better hurry back to Franklin. Shay, thank goodness! Quick! Help me with the rods! The map. Where is that? Portugal. Lisbon, I'd stake my life on it. Make yourself scarce, Shay. The militia will be here any minute. I'm sure they will have questions. What about you? I'm a devoted housekeeper. Right. Off the wind. 
house on sale! Lisbon is near as large as London or Paris. Are you sure you can find this one place? Saw so it clear as day, Hope. It's a convent, right close by the harbor. I might have visited the sisters once or twice. Given your present knowledge of the site, this duty falls upon you. You understand what must be done? Find the Precursor Temple and retrieve the Peace of Eden. Finally obtained a ship for crossing the ocean. Have no worries. I will keep the Morrigan safe in New York. Thank you. Liam and I will leave straight away. Liam is unavailable at present. Your crew and ship await. Be careful, Shay. Pieces of Eden are powerful relics. Feast of all saints. What a sight. And here I am, looking for a relic from the time before Adam and Eve. <laughs> Strange days indeed. Benedictus es, Domine, Deus Universi, quia de tua largitate acepimus vinum. Uo tibi oferimus, fructum vitis et operis manum hominum, ex uo nobis diet votus espiritalis. In nomine Patris et Fili et Spiritus Sancti. Gloria Domini Nostri Jesu Christi, et Caritas Dei, et Comunicatio Sancti Spiritus, sit cum omnibus vobis. Et Consumitum.
nomine, Deus universi qui ad etua l'arditate a cepibus vinum, vuotivi operibus, fructum vitis et operis manum omitum, ex quo nobis diet potus espiritalis. Orate, fratres, ut meum ac vestrum sacrificium attentabile fritabut Deum Patrem Oficentem. Precursor site. What do we have here? The artifact.
God do this to them? God had nothing to do with this. So what's the next city you want me to smite? What happened in Haiti, happened in oh Portugal. A great earthquake, thousands dead <gasps> next to your damned manuscript. This cannot be. Jay, a person cannot start an earthquake. A person meddling with these precursor machines could. You saw the box, Hope. The temple was filled to bursting with that kind of power. You made me slaughter innocents. How dare you? You defend him? Achilles sent me in there like Machandal sent his man in Haiti. What the he hell's knew. going on? Stop this! The operation was delicate. Perhaps you... You are shifting the earth itself. Who are you to decide what city falls next? Get him out of here. Liam is a fool if he thinks I'll leave this be. Achilles cannot be trusted. He must never find another Precursor Temple. I don't care that he's Mentor, or that his family is dead. There's no excuse for this level of madness. Only one thing to do. There's no turning back now. I had such hopes for you, Shay. Achilles. I have to do this. And what is it you're doing, exactly? Stealing from your brothers? Betraying me? Someone must make amends. Make amends? You have no idea what you're doing. The future of the whole continent, maybe the whole world, is tied up in that manuscript. Perhaps. But we don't have the right to decide that future. The right? We have the responsibility! We are responsible for killing innocents and destroying cities. This mad grab for power. It ends now. I will not let you destroy everything we have built! <laughs> Assassins! Stop him! Stop Shay! You there! Stop! Run! Run away! What is the La Verde doing? Our 
our plans. Have you gone mad? Stop! Won't you listen to reason, Shay? Stop you! How does it feel now? <clears throat> Hit him from here. <clears throat> Could you, Shay? Damn you! You will have to run faster than that. You are in huge trouble now. I'll find you, kill you, and I'll piss in your skull. Damn you! Together, lads. <laughs> That's enough! Give back the manuscript, Shay! I'm sure Achilles- I cannot! I will not let this happen again! All oh, those souls lost! One more hardly matters. Shay! <laughs> What is this? A glitch in the memories. There seems to be more data. Okay, Numskull. I can't pull you out of the chair right now. You'll just have to see this through. This is bizarre. These memories seem to take place some 20 years after the one we just saw. Are you certain? Positive. This means... Shay must have survived that fall. If he is the man I believe him to be, then he has. Keep going. The data is fragmented. This memory is incomplete. Let me see what I can do. Listen up. We need to find out what Shay's up to. This memory's gonna look a little rough. But I'm like 90% sure sequencing this memory won't kill you. Alright, Namsa. We don't know where Shay is or what he's doing now. So keep your eyes and ears open. I want to know the reason Shay came to this place. You heard the man. Let's move. 